So you'll find, and these are nationwide products, nationwide rentals. And I mean, right behind us, this is our typical use case. But other than this, we have them on rent to hospitals, farms, malls. Mm -hmm. Um, I mean, really anything, anywhere that people need to watch over their assets and even use this as a job site management uh, tool. It's really eyes in the skies for that. Okay. Yep. So security and then project management. Is yes, kind of the main exactly. Uses. Yep. Nice. So Dave, um, tell us kind of about the camera head itself, uh, the, the brand and kind of some of the features of the camera. Absolutely. So we're an access house. Uh, all of our cameras that are going to be on our units are access. They're PTZ and infrared. And uh, on that bulldozer over there, I mean, from 400 yards away, we're able to zoom in and read about a uh, 12 inch font. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, nice. and it's HD quality. Okay. Um, what about motion alerts? Mm -hmm. So I have all these assets here and it's the weekend. Mm -hmm. Somebody's coming on site. Is there a way for this to tell me that? Absolutely, yes. Yeah. So we, we set up geofences okay. and that's all done remotely. And uh, what that is, is if a vehicle or human crosses into that plane, mm -hmm. the customer's team would receive an email alert with a screenshot of what the camera saw and a timestamp and everything. And you'll be able to go in and view that and, and see that footage. Okay, very nice. Um, talking a little bit about the live stream and how we actually view the feed of mm -hmm. the camera, what are my options there? Yeah. So. Like everything, I mean, it's as easy as just downloading our secure app on your phone or using your uh, your laptop for this, but you can have one to as many trailers as you want in one dashboard view, view it live, control the camera. If it's noon and I wanna look back to see what was going on at 8 a.m. on the job site, can I do that right from my app or the desktop as well? If we have our motion to record yep. setting set, okay, you can. Nice, okay, and just to clarify, I don't to be at the trailer to do any of this, is that right? Correct, so you could be located in California, it'll be trailers viewing live in Florida. So in terms of how long it takes to set this unit up, what's the process mm -hmm. and how long does it take to, to get this thing live on my job site? Yep, so from the word go from our customers, these get shipped directly to their job site. And really the only setup there is, is to just mount the camera head. The camera heads are shipped inside the battery box okay. and it's as easy as tightening the three bolts to hold it into that clamshell mount yep. plug in the ethernet cable and it's live it's online okay yeah. and i obviously that you can tow these with a truck yes yep any normal truck i've i was actually deploying these at a college in uh, tennessee and i used a golf cart golf cart yeah okay so they're pretty yeah. mobile pretty mobile and then nice. for security too yep it just takes a typical trailer lock we recommend one on the tongue and on the mass and the battery box, and it's it's secure. All right, um, let's talk about power. How how are these things getting powered? Mm -hmm. Do I need to keep a diesel generator nearby to keep it operational? Tell me about that. Yep. No gas, no noise from these things. It's completely solar powered. So we have hundreds hundreds of watts of solar on each trailer. Yep. This isn't like your fifth grade uh, calculator. It's this thing's going to be running autonomously. So. This continues, uh, continuous charge is our battery bank inside the battery box. Mm -hmm. And um, really what we say to our customers is you set it up and forget it because it'll just keep working for you. Okay. Um, and they're communicating back to your software how? Yes, each, each uh, trailer has a cell modem in it. Okay. And we have just a dual SIM modem and that's how it's going to be communicating back to, to you and us. Okay. Next, yes. So as long as I'm in an area that has cellular connectivity. Mm -hmm. I can view it live stream. In the event I don't have cellular signal, mm -hmm. what would, could I still use these things? Absolutely. Okay. And so what that looks like in those very remote job sites yep. is plug them in, set it up, and then it will just be banking on the uh, the recording of okay. it then. So on then the we, SD card? On the SD card, okay. yes. So we just download that and then we'd send it off uh, to, to the customers. Nice. Okay. Um, once it's on my job site, you know, do I, do I have to move it around a lot to mm -hmm. get a better vantage point of the property or talk mm -hmm. about that? Yeah. Uh, you know, we, a lot of the times and when we're most successful is when we have these preliminary conversations with the customers. They send us the layout of their job site so it's as easy as just getting it from Google Earth. Yep. We talk about where we should place them. And then, I mean, this thing goes up 20 feet, this mast. and. You know, we just play around with the angles. We set it up in a patrol mode, so which is viewing your job site and all your assets all at once. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Talk about that blue light up top. Mm -hmm. What's that for? <laughs> um, that is a visual deterrent. So okay. it has a photo cell in it. Completely solar powered, and that can recognize it uh, when when it's dawn. So it'll be running from dawn to dusk, and it's just a very nice, bright uh, visual deterrent to keep folks off your job site. Awesome. Mm -hmm. um, talk about the most unique project or customer you've ever had for these trailers. Mm -hmm. What were they using them for? <laughs> um, the most unique was an oil refinery. Okay. In the Midwest, um, and they had. A large amount of these on rent okay. and it was just monitoring all sorts of stuff there's spill off spill off uh ponds mm -hmm. and um and then just monitoring the day-to-day -day activities of contract workers their workers and and then just the the the, the construction site there nice yeah. and how many units did they have on their facility if you can remember <laughs> uh, i believe it was uh 15. 15 trailers yes nice 